Hello and welcome. This video is going to talk about hybrid scenarios and uh, how we run those. We've got a, a few of these that we've designed uh, for our fundamentals classes. Um, the one I'm going to show you today is uh, NG tube insertion with this task trainer. And that's really what um, a hybrid scenario is. So uh, it involves a piece of software. Um, you'll be running these off of our Surface Pros. Uh, typically, we'll have uh, three or four of the Surface Pros out in stations next to a task trainer. And uh, so you'll do a skill like NG tube insertion, and then you'll have uh, this handy little checklist to follow along, and that will help you um, really help you uh, develop your skills um, as you do um, as you do these these training sessions. So um, you can see I have it highlighted right here. Uh, the NG tube insertion skills assessment one for leap and then um, on this side it just gives you uh, a little bit of the background and the scenario outline of um, what you're uh, going to be working with today so I'm going to load it up I'm going to click OK so um, the only thing that the student running the software, so the idea is that you'll have one student actually just run the checklist and then another student will do the skill station and then um, you could do it in, in many different ways. If you got uh, plenty of time, uh, I would recommend that you uh, just go through each step by step um, doing it that way and then try to do it without being prompted. So if you want to kind of start or wake up the software, it always starts when you load a scenario. It always starts off in this state of pause, as you can see right here. So we just want to wake the software up by clicking the play button. And um, this is all touch screen when you use it to Surface Pros. If you're having trouble with the touch screen, let me know. I, I do have keyboard attachments that I can, I can give to you. But um, for what we've experienced, the touch screens work just fine. So when the student's ready to go, you just click Start Scenario. And then here you go. You got uh, this, uh, you got you get a checklist here under preparation, and then you're just gonna kind of go through these tabs until you reach the end. So the idea here is that you'll start on the left and work your way to the right. So these are all the steps that should be taken when you're doing these skills. So um, you just start and work through it um, as you do. It's really kind of straightforward. Uh, again, if you're first running it, again, you can prompt uh, to help your fellow student out. Um, when it comes to faculty, the faculty may get to a point where they really want to see if you've learned anything or not. Then they can use this as a tool to grade because um, these are the steps that um, they're expecting you to, to master. Um, especially on skills checkoff at the end of the semester. So keep that in mind. So we're going to go through these here and there. I won't we'll click them all. And we'll end and evaluate. So it, it does give you a grade at the end. So you can see I scored 18 and 32. That's not very well. Um, but you can get grades out of this. But um, you would really would just want to uh, use this initially as a learning tool to develop your, your skill set and the, the flow of how these hybrid scenarios work and how you can master your skill, skills. And then uh, it's the faculty member's responsibility when it comes to checkoffs um, to, to do the actual grading for you. But you can get a pretty good idea of how these work for you. Thank you for your time.